Good day, everyone. I'm sure you're all wondering how I got this pretty. Okay, now why don't you take this journey with me? Let's go. Let's start off with a satin skin facial primer. Apply it as generously and as evenly as possible on your face. You may use your finger and you may use a tool called the brush. And as quick as your hands can go, apply it as evenly as possible on your face, under the eyes, on your forehead. The objective here is to be as pale as possible and that's in preparation of all the makeups I'm gonna put on my face later on. You may use a brush, it tickles, it looks fancy, it feels good. There. Once you look like Edward Cullen, Cullen you may start using the Elf Eye Eyebrow Pencil. And just like in kindergarten or in elementary, draw the best possible eyebrow that you can. And then you use a concealer. That concealer is used to kind of cover up all the excess eyebrow pencil that you put. Now you moisturize your eyelid. You may use your finger and then you may use this brush. And then you use an NYC gold number two on your eyelid. You may use your finger. At this point of the day, you can see you don't see much reaction from that side of my face because it's already numb. It does not feel a thing, so it does not hurt at all. Then you use a versus. You use a violet versus when you use a brush on your eyelid. This process is called eyeshadowing. And then you may use a brush. So on the side, and then this this is the critical point. You use a grip, a uh, patent, eye, eyelash curler. See? And this is where Maybelline comes in. So with surgical precision, with surgical precision, you put it just below or just above the actual eyeball and use it as best as you can and make sure not to hurt yourself further than you already have. And then draw, draw. Kind of like extend it to the side and make your eyes appear longer, at least the opening, longer than it, it really is. And no, that is not a caterpillar or anything. That is what you call a falsy or a false eyelashes. Then you use a hyper curl. That, that thing is called a mascara. I don't know why I had to do this after I put it on when I could have put it before. But then remember your eyelashes are not limited to the upper eye. You also have some on the bottom of your eye so you use it on that part too. And then you use a BYS gold number three. This part is called contouring. This is where you really create an illusion of depth. And then you use a brush and you do the Angelina Jolie thing with your lips so that your face and skin extends and you can pl apply makeup as evenly as possible and then you use the number two. Use a brush. Use another brush. This one's very different from the other one. It might look the same but it's not. I swear it's different. And then you use an aub. So what it is is a spongy thing. Which tickles actually, you see me smiling here. So you dab it on your face, and then this is the part wherein you use an, um, a lip pencil. So you use it to add, uh, to add some sort of a, of a grid on your lips, and then this is what you call a lipstick. You guessed it right, that is a lipstick. And see, voila, I do not look like a baby girl anymore. I have a, a bunny ear and look how pretty I am. So I'm going to say bye now and I'm going to do a baby girl wave. Bye. Thank you all for watching. I hope you enjoyed as much as I did. Subscribe Instagram at Angel Andra, blog at www.blogangelandrade at dot wordpress.com and you may visit www.angelandrade-blog.tumblr.com 
again thank you very much for watching i hope you have a wonderful 2017 good night